As we start this gospel reflection, let us imagine the Sea of Galilee, also called Lake Gennesaret, where some of the apostles used to dedicate their working hours fishing in their boats. After an entire day's work, they came back with no results. No doubt, they must have been quite disappointed and uh, downcast. There was a lot of work for nothing. Our Lord Jesus approached them and kindly suggested that they should go out again and this time try throwing the nets on the right side of the boat. Saint Luke tells us that Simon answered, Master, we toiled all night and took nothing, but at your word I will let down the nets. And when they had done this, they caught a great number of fish and their nets were breaking. Without Jesus, it is always nighttime in our heart. Peter, a fisherman by trade, had not caught anything, even though he had been working hard. This can happen to us too, even when we're working to bring others closer to Christ. When everything seems to be going well and you rely on your own effort, that is when you're closest to failure. There's nothing worse for our spiritual growth than to rely on our own strength. There can be an appearance of success, but God says through the psalmist, unless the Lord builds the house, the builder labors in vain. And our Lord said also in the gospel, without me, you can do nothing. So take a minute to consider. Do you regu regularly ask God for help regarding your daily activities? Do you truly re rely on God's providence in everything you do? What a difference when one works with Christ. With Him, we are never alone. With Him, even if there's crosses, you know things will work out according to His will. When you rely on Christ and do the work that you're supposed to do, you will surely be successful in God's eyes, even though there may be moments of difficulty, even if the world doesn't see what you did even if you don't achieve visible, tangible results. So think for a moment. When things get tough, do you become despondent and lose confidence in God? Or do you try to see the real success, a real success which is being faithful to God rather than pleasing to the world? Oh. Uh...